Hey Aaron, Pa here from Eagle Ridge GM in Coquitlam. I thought I'd get a nice walk around video for you. I had the pleasure of dealing with Ross just earlier when he was in, uh, and we had the chance to go through his beautiful 2016 GMC Sierra Denali behind me. Now, great news, the truck is still here and available, as you can see behind me. Um, and I thought I'd get a nice walk around video for you since you're not local to Vancouver and you can't necessarily just head in here. Now, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get this nice video for you. Now, uh, the video won't do justice all about how beautiful this truck is. Now, as far as the paint and everything goes, excellent condition. There are some light scratches that are all surface scratches. Anything can be buffed or polished out. Um, no sort of deep scratches whatsoever that we really noticed. Uh, and I was pointing out to Ross, if it's something that bothers you, we can always look into those options as well. Um, but the gorgeous thing is, it's a crew cab standard box, so it's going to be uh, beautiful for the family. You guys are going to have a ton of space. Uh, and then pretty much if I come around to the back, you're going to see it has a gorgeous canopy on it uh, from Capit. I'm going to go ahead and unlock it. Pretty much it folds up. It has two hydraulic arms. Um, just in the rear over here, you also get a nice backup camera. Now I'm going to go ahead and drop the tailgate. It has a slow release, which is nice and it comes with a bed liner and a nice carpeted insulated canopy. And pretty much it's gonna be nice if you guys ever wanna camp in the back of your truck, also a great idea. I'm gonna go ahead and close the, uh, the tailgate and lock that up and it locks shut, which is nice. And just step away for here for a second and you're gonna see it has rear sensors all over the uh, bumper, which pretty much uh, it's nice for safety. And obviously when you're getting uh, close to stuff and you know, all the beeping and sensors and everything that these trucks have, which are nice. Obviously it has a hitch as well with the four and seven pin wiring harness. And then if I continue my walk around, uh, you're gonna see on this side, which pretty much uh, the Denali's come in two different wheel options. And this has the upgraded wheel setup, which has a 22 inch Denali wheels uh, wrapped in the Michelin Defender tires, which are an excellent setup. And I'm gonna go ahead and open up one of these doors and check this out. So those side steps open up, they're auto retracting and folding. And if I click this button in the back over here, check out what happens. So they come out and then they go over onto the bedside, which is really neat. You can always step up and get some from, something from your bed. If you're strapping something onto the top, you can always uh, kind of do that. But if I leave one of these doors open, and let's say I want to click that button again, what it does is that it's just a regular side step for getting in and out of the truck. Now, while we're here in the back, I'm going to show you the uh, back seat storage as well. So pretty much you're going to see there's a tremendous amount of, uh, of uh, room just for your rear passengers for the two kiddos you guys got. Uh, and over here up in the ceiling, take a look at all this indented ceiling. So they've given a ton of extra headroom, um, especially for the taller passengers. And all you do is just pull these rear seats up. And another nice thing is you get all of this rear cargo space. Now, these are some extra floor mats that come with the truck. Um, but if I'm to take them out, you get this nice flat area that you can always toss a sleeping bag or two onto uh, and pretty much sleep. And pretty much that one goes up as well. And all you do is give it a little tug, comes back down. Now, Aaron, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, just use the remote and I'm gonna show you a neat little feature that this truck comes with. Uh, obviously, all you do is just go ahead and lock the doors and then pretty much, oh, this door just not shut properly. Perfect. All you're gonna do is go ahead and uh, hit the lock button until it chirps and then hold this remote button right here. And what it does, it gives it a nice remote start. So especially in the winter times in Alberta, probably gonna be something necessary for you. I'm gonna go ahead and unlock the doors and then uh, pretty much just go ahead and hop in. Now, as far as the driver's seat goes, you get a 10-way power adjustable driver's seat uh, that comes paired with all the memory options. And then these buttons over here are to do with your mirrors, so you can adjust them. And a the button in the middle, what it does is it collapses your mirrors and you can pretty much open and close both of them uh, just with the click of a button, which is nice. And then these are all your windows and child lock and window lock and stuff. But I'm gonna go ahead and hop in and hold the uh, camera up at this angle. And uh, here, let me just toss the keys in and start the truck up. Pretty much the remote start will get the engine going, but all the features will stay unactivated just until you put the keys in. And go ahead and turn this right side up. And then pretty much come on over here and take a look at this low mileage at just 89,785 kilometers. And you get this nice massive digital screen in the middle with uh, the odometer and the RPM on either side. And pretty much all that is adjustable with the buttons on the right side of the steering wheel. So you can pretty much go through every single option and feature if you would like. Um, and pretty much tire pressure, all that sort of stuff. So that's all adjustable. You can put your speed up there if you would like. Um, and then these are your hands-free systems. So 
answering and hanging up calls. Front collision alert, that's a nice thing. So we can pretty much adjust the gap. So right now it's set at the furthest distance where when the vehicle in front of you breaks, it'll give you a warning and vibrate your seat telling you that, hey, you should slow down. Um, pretty much heat of steering wheel, cruise control, and then uh, all the wipers and everything are right over here. Now on the left side of the steering wheel, you get your trailer integrated trailer brake, two and four wheel drives, and then your interior and exterior lights over here. And on the back of the steering wheel, you get the uh, volume on this side and changing your different channels on the back of this side. So you never have to fiddle with your phone. Now, as far as the middle goes, uh, we're gonna go ahead and hit the home button and you can pretty much obviously connect your phone via Bluetooth uh, and control all your text messages and calls and everything. It does have a projection option, which is really neat about the Sierra Denali's. Um, you can project what's on your phone onto the screen. So your maps and stuff, which is really awesome. Um, and then there's a media button right over here. These are all the buttons that go along with your uh, entertainment system. And then these buttons over here are to go along with your uh, climate control. So you get dual climate. So basically on one side, if they want, let's say 20 degrees, on the other side, you want, uh, you know, 18, 16 degrees, you can have different temperatures or you could hit the sync button and it pretty much uh, gets them both at the same temperature, kind of controlled by the driver's side. I'm gonna go ahead and turn that off. And then on either side over here, you get heated and cooled seats, which is really awesome. Uh, so if you click it, the blue light comes on and then uh, you can hear it in the video probably, the AC seat goes on, which is a really nice feature in the summer and then the heated seats in the winter time. Um, these are your pedal adjustments, traction control. I like to call this one the jellyfish launcher, AKA the cargo bed lights. Um, this is your rear parking assist, which I'm actually gonna show you in a minute. Um, your lane keep assist to make sure you're staying within your lanes. And if you're going in and out of them, gives you a beeping and a vibrate. Uh, this is your downhill descent control. So when, especially when you're towing, all you do is punch that on. It, it's almost like an engine brake. It keeps you at the same pace at 30 kilometers and under. And this button is uh, your side step, so you can lock them in or out, so it constantly doesn't move in and out. Especially in the winter times, you don't want ice building up if they're closed, and then it yanks them open and uh, kind of hurts something. So you can uh, lock them in or out. As far as these go, these are all a bunch of different charging options. It's nice that they've given so many. Um, and then pretty much you get a bunch of cargo space over here. And check out this neat option. You get a Bluetooth charger. So once your phone is paired, all you do is just slap it on there and uh, it starts charging, which is really nice. And we're still not done. You get this massive sunroof above your head, which is really awesome. All you do is just with the click of one button, it, uh, it pretty much opens up. So you get a nice big sunroof. And then uh, actually behind me over there in the rear, uh, you actually get a uh, button to open up that window as well, which is really awesome. Um, and then pretty much, I know Ross also mentioned that you would like a video just with the uh, truck on running while I pop the hood. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. As, and the nice thing is, usually with the Denali's, you actually get the uh, 6.2 liter paired with it, which is a little bit harsher on gas than the 5.3. But guess what? This one actually comes with a beautiful 5.3, which you don't see very often, but it's, uh, it's a nice option because you're getting the Denali, you're getting the crew cab standard box, but with the 5.3, so you're getting the fuel efficiency and everything as well. But nice silent motor. I'm going to stop talking so you can hear it for a second. Perfect. Nice silent uh, engine. If there's any questions you have for me about this, feel free to ask me. We put a brand new battery in it and everything, and I have no problem send you guys, sending you guys the, uh, the safety inspection as well to see kind of what we've done. Um, but more or less, take a look at how just gorgeous this truck is, especially the front end of that. Like, what's going to beat that, right? <laughs> But awesome, Aaron, I hope you got an idea of this truck. And uh, if you have any questions, feel free to uh, reach me directly at 778-522-4190. That's my personal cell phone. Again, Aaron, that's 778-522-4190. Um, and Ross, if you've had a chance to view this video as well, again, feel free to reach out to me. Um, and I look forward to uh, serving you guys at the highest level and uh, getting you down the road in this beautiful Denali. We'll chat soon. Bye-bye.